I really appreciate how being recognized for it, but I really enjoy teaching and being able to put in the echelon of people that have received this award before. Uh, it's really humbled me and as I said in there, uh, this school, the environment of this school with the, the, with the students and the staff, um, I get to teach students that are every day ready to learn and they want to know more. I remember one time I had a student tell me that when he comes into class, it's like I tell him every day that there's a new color he didn't know about. So he was just uh, being able to share my passion with my students is really good. And the staff here is unbelievable. When I walk up and down the halls, um, I get excited about what they're doing and they push me to get better. I, I did an undergrad in physics at the University of Windsor and I've always found the subject fascinating and being able to bring it to students and kind of helping them learn that, what I call the secrets of nature, um, I find that they love it too. So. My passion kind of rubs off on them. I do a lot of research on my own about the best ways of teaching physics, and physics is a, luckily physics is a subject where we all experience the everyday world. So a lot of us have built-in mental models of how the world works, and I kind of tap into those, and we do a lot of inquiry-based learning in the classroom where I'm more, of a, I'm more of on the side facilitating than really being up at the board teaching. So I, they do a lot of inquiry-based learning in my classroom where we're, um, where they're taking those ideas that they have and we're just, you know, applying a little bit of math to them and making them a little bit more formal.